Hi everyone and happy Mother's Day to all of the mothers uh, in our Bubbles group. Today I'm going to read you a story called All in One Piece and it's a very funny story and it shows and reminds us that mothers, well even though we're not perfect, we can still have a good time. And most importantly, we can remember that God loves us. Mr. Large was getting ready for work. Don't forget the office dinner dance tonight, dear, he said. Of course I won't, said Mrs. Large. I've been thinking about it all year. Are children allowed at the dinner dance? asked Lester. No, said Mrs. Large. It'll be too late. Granny's coming to take care of everyone, said Mrs. Large. Granny arrived at tea time. Granny gave them some painting to do while she tidied up and Mr. and Mrs. Large went upstairs to get ready. Luke sneaked into the bathroom while Mr. Large was shaving. Will I have to shave when I grow up, he asked, patting foam onto his trunk. Go away, said Mr. Large. I don't want you ruining my best trousers. The baby crept into the bedroom where Mrs. Large was putting on her makeup. Mrs. Large didn't notice until it was too late. Look, said the baby, pretty. Oh, don't move, said Mrs. Large. Don't touch anything. Outside, on the landing, Lester and Luke were seeing how many toys they could cram into her new tights. Downstairs at once, bellowed Mrs. Large. Can't I just have one night in the whole year to myself? The children went downstairs to Granny. Mr. Large followed soon after, very smart in his best suit. At last, Mrs. Large appeared in the doorway. How do I look? she asked. Pretty, Mummy, gasped the children. What a smasher, said Mr. Large. Mr. and Mrs. Large got ready to leave. Goodbye, everyone, they said. Be good now. We've escaped, said Mr. Large with a smile, closing the front door behind them. All in one piece, said Mrs. Large, and not a smear of paint between us. Actually, said Mr. Large gallantly, You'd look wonderful to me, even if you were covered in paint. Which was perfectly true, and just as well, really. Can you see the paint on Mrs. Large's dress? Oh dear. Hi there. Today we're going to make a craft of hearts for Mother's Day. You'll need some crayons, a piece of paper, a paintbrush and some water, and some watercolour colours to paint with. First, we're going to draw a heart with one of your colours. You can do it as big or as small as you like, but I'm going to do a few. When you're done, we're going to get your, your paintbrush, get the colours that you want and paint over the hearts. You can put it inside or over the whole thing, doesn't matter. Thank you. 
And there's your picture. If you can see, the crayon still shows through the watercolour paint. Have fun making it and giving it to your mum.